1 minus 3 gives us negative 2. And again here inside this parenthesis, we have 1 minus 3. So negative 2 times negative 2 gives us positive 4. But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, first we have to do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. And the same applies to addition and subtraction. In this expression, we have one subtraction, one multiplication, and the one parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have one subtraction. Here we have a multiplication because in mathematics, when a number is placed next to parentheses, it means multiplication. And we usually don't write the multiplication sign for brevity. Okay, so according to the PEMDAS, first we have to do this parenthesis, then this multiplication, and the finally this subtraction. If we do this subtraction before this multiplication or this parenthesis, it is wrong. So first this parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have 1 minus 3, which equals negative 2. So 1 minus 3, then times negative 2. Now we have one subtraction and one multiplication. According to the PEMDAS, multiplication has higher priority than subtraction because multiplication comes before subtraction. So here, first we have to do this multiplication. 3 times negative 2 gives us negative 6. So we have 1 minus negative 6. No, negative times negative gives us positive. So we have 1 plus 6. And this is all equal to 7. So we have 7. And this is our final answer to this problem. The correct answer is 7.